Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. This lesson will be Detroit Rock City from the Eric Carr era. Um, I believe it's 19, the 1988 solo. In the intro you've got the guitar playing, which is... So we have right, left, right, left, right, left, right, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. So, so. So in the verse, instead of playing our normal rock beat of, um, or this is kind of a triplet feel like. We put two snare drum hits, so. So the verse has those two hits. So we keep the hi-hat going as crotches. One, two, three, four. Now I've got three different snare drums, so you'll hear the different sounds. that bigger sound you could do now let's do the hi-hat and snare drum part completely here we go The next part we're going to add the bass drum in, in more of a simple pattern. The next part goes like this. A little bit quicker. That's the verse part. What I'll do now, I'll play the intro again, but add a few of the fills.
that's the intro and the verse. Before the bridge, he does a bit of an extended triplet phrase. So instead of going, he does a full bar build up. So it goes, he does a two bar build up. With the build up, Peter Chris will play it pretty straightforward, not too many accents. Same with Eric Carr. There's a couple of bits and pieces in there, but not too much. When we go to Eric Singer, he actually misses one of the notes. So he plays this. So Eric Singer's pattern sounds like this slowed down. So work on both of those patterns. You've got your intro and the verse. Now I'll play one more thing, which is the way Eric Singer plays the verse pattern. So Eric Singer plays a lot of double pedal. So we're going to have those triplets in there. So he plays So you can experiment with that. So we go. <laughs> <laughs> 